Sasha and um, it's my first ever YouTube video. In fact, I'm planning to, to start my channel. The channel will be about anything like my lifestyle, my previous experience, my life current in quarantine. The most exciting thing um, I've done in quarantine is I've finally got a puppy, which I was planning to get once, you know, once it's over and then once I get maybe into a relationship, by the way, I'm single. Maybe into day or move into the different house at the moment that I live in the apartment but you know what I thought that was my bravest decision I've ever made in fact um ever it's only when I got him he was um eight weeks old so and the things that when I got him I didn't even res I haven't done research whatsoever but only thing I knew is I wanted to have I, uh, a dog that doesn't uh, lose the hair so a hair or has like a like a human pretty much hair and I was considering I was considering two types of dog two breeds a poodle and a Yorkshire Terrier very clever it's uh, secondly they easy to teach third they don't lose the hair so you can like brush them trim them that i can't wait to do that they don't stink they they just don't smell so i've got myself a toy poodle i was probably it took me probably like less than a month maybe it's good three weeks to find a puppy i know the price is extremely expensive especially the fact that um um, you know, like quarantine, everyone wants to get a dog because they're bored and they don't understand what's the responsibility like. I mean, come on, guys, if you are bored because you're in quarantine, you have to think ahead. Can you have the dog long term? By the way, he's not allowed to go outside at the moment because we haven't had a second. That's a different story. I'm going to tell in a minute. But anyway, let me bring him on and then I can look at him. He's so cute, he's adorable. No, I love you, 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 I know, I love you. And he's literally so, so small, like look, I can... But yeah, he grew, he grew. Whoever wants to get a puppy or a dog, please make sure you do check all the information what's on there, as well as vaccines. If you are getting puppy, a puppy must have two vaccines on the registered card. So here, we've only got one. Well, I didn't know that, did I? Eight or nine vets around the area, radius of 10 kilometers. None of them had this type of vaccine. Called Vanguard. And that's like, oh, no, we don't do that. I was like, I found the closest vet that does the same vaccination brand Vanguard in Royston. I mean, it's not bad. It's not Cambridge. I don't need to go like 60 miles. This is the, best. This is the huge tip ever. When you're getting a puppy, make sure your vaccination card has two vaccine, one and two, the same brand. If they don't have the same brand, then ask question why they have this not the same brand. Anyway. How to properly feed your dog or and include your own food into dog's food. This video I'm gonna show you how I'm doing it right now. Uh, the previous uncle, oh, the breeder, um, they used to feed him like pedigree brand. Uh, and it's mainly like, you know, just I call it artificial food because I don't, you know, I don't really trust it, but yeah, but you do have to uh, start it very slowly in terms of combining food um, because they're very uh, sensitive. Their stomach is very sensitive. So yeah, be careful. What I've done now, I boiled chicken legs and carrots. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to cut it in small pieces, put it in here. Every time I make his bowl, I'm going to add a bit of that and then, and then and a bit of my food. So let's do it. Wanna make a new start Walk me
me through this broken glass Wanna feel my blood rise Throw these windows open wide Illuminate This is how it looks so far Pretty small pieces and this is like his container for the next three, four dice um this may like literally this is so easy to make like um if you can just boil it or whatever but i do have this pressure cooking thing which is amazing i literally it took me five minutes in the pressure cooker and that's it and now yes, I'm ready. while i'm cooking his dinner he's actually fast asleep like he's so cute this is his crave um it's soft um it's huge i know i didn't want to waste like time on buying another crave which will be pretty much the same size but yeah so i've currently borrowed it from my parents they've had they have hungarian visa i've cut half of it well i blocked it so you can't access it um so what i was saying normally if the crave is too big and dogs end up peeing and pooing on one side and sleeping on the other side and then they think it's okay it's okay so. guys thank you so much for watching me it's my first ever youtube video i hope i, won I wasn't that bad and i hope everybody could understand me until the next video bye, bye.